Hey friends, so Rollins and I are here at Bordeaux Lakes Campground, which is basically the entrance to the Cabot Trail, because you're seven kilometers away from Bedeck, and that would be on Cape Breton Island in Nova Scotia. So as far as campgrounds go, you're looking at a good Sam Top 100 Park. Uh, they got a recent rating of 10 out of 10 across the board. So you're in good hands. Now the owners are John and Betty, and they've owned this campground for 22 years. They actually were in this area on vacation and staying in the cottages up the hill over here. And by the time they were ready to go home, they'd realized that they were thinking about getting some land around here. On the way out of the cottages, they noticed that the campground was for sale. By the time they got home, they owned a campground. Now back then, it was in pretty rough shape. So, since then, over the past 22 years, they've been doing what they can to fix it up, to get it to this point, and they're doing an awesome job. It's a really well-maintained campground with so many amenities, I'm just going to rapid fire these off um, because I will not be able to get through the full list without editing it anyways. So, here we go. You have 98 sites. Most of those are three-way sites, meaning full hookups, power, sewer, and water. Some of them are two-way sites, power and water. Some of them are unserviced tent sites. As far as the power sites go, you have 15 amp, 30 amp, and 50 amp. Some of them are pull-through and many of them are back-ins. You have a rec area. You have a pet area. You have a swimming pool with a sitting area around it. You have a clubhouse with games, darts, and a lending library. Also, it's a fair enough size that if you needed to have a small meeting of some sort for a group that you may be here with, uh, there's that option as well. You have free Wi-Fi. There's lake access where you can get to the water to swim, launch a canoe, launch a kayak. And to the right of that is a nice little area that's up uh, built on a bit of a seawall. But it's a nice level area with picnic tables and chairs where you can sit and relax and enjoy the view of the lake. If RVing is not your thing, but you're coming through the area and still looking for a place to stay, they have six cabins. Three of them are luxury cabins with a queen size bed, bunk beds, a bathroom with a shower. They come with a screened off porch, a fire pit, a picnic table, and your own barbecue. Now the basic cabins are much more rustic and much more basic. They are basically nice little cabins with a double bed and bunk beds for the kids. There's a camp store with basic amenities and a gift shop. And I saved the best for last. I believe this is Betty and John's pride and joy at this moment. And they are very, very proud of their new washrooms. Uh, the washroom building is pristine. The washrooms are great. The free hot showers are great. They're clean, they're big, and if you're kind of green conscious, they just finished implementing a full on-site water treatment plant that was recently tested. And basically the guy said that the water coming out of their treatment plant is pretty much drinkable. So know that they're doing their part and trying to keep the environment a little cleaner. Also within the washroom and shower building is a corn operated laundry with two washers and two dryers. So if you're here for a while and you need to get some laundry done, Again, very clean, great working order, you're in good hands. So I'm going to show you around Betty and John's fabulous campground. And if you're ever in this area and you're looking for a place to stay, highly recommend this one.
So friends, there you have it. The Bredore Lake Campground, about seven kilometers from Badek on beautiful Cape Breton Island at the start of the Cabot Trail in Nova Scotia. What else do you need? If you're looking for more Nova Scotia videos, make sure you click the subscribe button. There's more coming soon, including my visit to the village of Badek. And from there, many more. So you know what to do with the little buttons and the icons. We'll talk to you soon and I'll see you all later.